where does the CO2 come from that we use in this industry? Well, first of all, it's important to understand the types of sources that we use. When we're recovering CO2 and, and liquefying it to a high grade and taking it in the market, we're looking for, for you know, we're looking hard at the economics. So we're looking at very pure sources of CO2. Um, CO2 is everywhere, but most of the sources that are used for this market are uh, sources that have uh, emission stream that are about 85, 95% pure CO2. So very pure uh, waste streams of CO2 that we capture out of and we purify into liquid grade, food and beverage grade CO2. Where are those sources? Uh, primarily, globally, ammonia plants, ammonia production is the primary source for this raw CO2 that gets further processed for the merchant market. About 25% of the CO2 produced into this market comes from ammonia in North America, and that, that figure is about 50% in Europe. So our market is highly re reliant on ammonia production to provide the raw materials we need to produce high-grade liquid CO2. Um, the second source is hydrogen production, mainly at refineries that's used in refinery processes. That's about 25% globally. Bioethanol is kind of the newcomer. Um, over the last 15 years, that's grown from maybe a percent to 20% uh, globally overall. And then we also have natural sources of CO2, which come out of the ground and CO2 that's associated with natural gas. When they sweeten natural gas, there's a nice pure stream of CO2 that comes out of that as well. That's probably about 20% of the uh, source, source sourcing for CO2 into this merchant market. And then there's a handful of, of other various sources that make up maybe four or 5%.